Hi, Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So once again, it seems that Microsoft is starting to push out and display a full screen pop-up on Windows 10, where they are wanting users now once again to upgrade to Windows 11. Now, this is not the first time uh, that this has happened. And as I posted about a year ago, um, there was a full screen Windows 11 ad offering to upgrade to the latest Windows 11 operating system back then. And if for, if for whatever reason you're interested in that, I'll leave that video down below. But this is now the same thing happening again. So once again, these, as I called them, these annoying nag ads are starting to now appear once again for some users on Windows 10. And as we can see, this is a full screen pop-up when you restart your device, which basically highlights um, the so-called free upgrade to Windows 11. Now, this is just one of four screens that um, is displayed. And obviously, um, yeah, we've got Microsoft recommends Windows 11 for your PC. And yeah, it says a familiar feel, what you need when you when and where you need it and try without worry. And then, yeah, we've got de decline upgrade, which is the so-called less um, kind of promoted text. And then you've got download while using my PC with this blue toggle kind of highlighting and drawing your attention to that. So obviously, Microsoft getting a little bit assertive again, trying to get Windows 10 users to upgrade to Windows 11 if the hardware of that device is supporting Windows 11. Now, apparently, um, this pop-up is showing now for some users once again. And obviously, this is if your hardware um, is upgradable to Windows 11 if you are running Windows 10. And the nag ad or pop-up screen once again is displayed after the most recent optional bug fix update for Windows 10 that rolled out near the end of January, KB5034203. So after this update was pushed out, um, users now, some users are reporting and there are reports that that ad, full screen ad is showing when you restart your device. Now, um, as many of you may know, and as I've mentioned previously on the channel, when it comes to market share, uh, Windows 10 is still far ahead of Windows 11, where Windows 11 currently is sitting on approximately 400 million users, and it is expected to reach 500 by, th by um, basically the end of this year, 2024. And Windows 10, though, is give or take over 1 billion is installed on over 1 billion PCs that are running Windows 10. So Windows 10 still has a huge chunk of the market share, as I've been talking about on this channel. So obviously, um, this could be a reason why Microsoft now is starting to get a little bit assertive again and push out this and these full screen prompts or ads or nag ads, as I call them. Because obviously, um, according to Microsoft, Windows 10's... Um, the, the support for Windows 10 is officially ending on the 14th of October next year, 2025. So obviously Microsoft is wanting to speed that process up to get Windows 10 users who can upgrade to Windows 11 over to Windows 11. But personally, as I've mentioned, um, even with this so-called um, attempt to um, get Windows 10 users to install Windows 11 and upgrade, I personally, as I've mentioned on the channel previously, I personally don't think that Microsoft is going to end support for Windows 10 officially in October of next year, 2025. And uh, that's because there's just too much market share still that Windows 10 is holding as an OS. But nonetheless, just uh, bring it to your attention. If you are seeing that ad, um, if you were unaware where it's coming from, it's after installing this optional bug fix update um, on your Windows 10 device that rolled out near the end of January. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.